Hello folks, Josh here from Atomic Cards bringing you another unboxing video and today we have got the Celebrations Elite Trainer Box. So this is part of this 25th anniversary Celebrations collection. Lots and lots of hype about this collection and this is one of the products that everyone will be after, the Elite Trainer Box. So what are we going to get inside this one? You're going to get your 10 Celebrations Packs, 5 regular packs, special foil card featuring Gold Star Greninja, 65 card sleeves, 45 energy cards, Player's Guide to the Expansion, Pokemon TCG Rulebook, 6 damage counter dice, Competition Legal Coin Flip Die, 2 Acrylic Condition Markers, Collector's Box, with four dividers and a code card, of course. So, let's tear the plastic up on this one and have a look. So, I was hoping this would be our first Celebrations product that we were able to get hold of. Um, we have already opened a drag pull box, because they came in stock first. So, if you want to see that video, there will be a link for you at the end or underneath so you can go and check that one out, see what you're getting in that box as well. So there we go, plastic is off. Slide that out. Pop that back there for a minute. So that is the cardboard sleeve. Not a lot on the inside, just a nice 25 logo. Quite simple. Nice matte finish on the top as well. It's cardboard sleeve. And here is your player's guide. Now this shows you all the cards you are going to get in here. Explains a little bit about the subset. For those of you that don't know, you've got a 25 card main set and a 25 card subset in here. So here is what you're going to get in the main set. These Pikachu cards. Definitely high on my list of ones I want. Professor's Research. And then the Mew. This is going to be the chase card for a lot of people. And that is the end of that first set. And then the Blastoise, Charizard, Venusaur start the second set which shows the reprints those three obviously high up on the list of most people as well only 50 cards in the whole set so a lot of people should be able to complete this one but four cards in a pack and you are only got a chance of getting one of those full arts or one from the subset. But let's get this box open, see what we've got in here. The cardboard innards, as always. Rule book. Sleeves. Very nice pattern on the back. Matte finish on the front by the looks of it. Which I know some people don't like. Doesn't feel like it gives us cards as shiny a feel as they could have. Block of energy cards. Standard. Condition markers, your dice, anything special? Oh, there we go. That one has got the Celebrations logo on the side there. There's your number one. Nice. If you're into that kind of thing. Let's 
we've got the dividers again standard with the logo on black Pikachu tail and then we have got the Greninja Gold Star promo card. Let's get this open and have a look. Very nice card. Do like the hollow on this. Looks quite dramatic. And a Gold Star. It's like with all the promos in this set. They're taking the old mechanics of the Gold Star and putting it onto new Pokemon. So Greninja wasn't around in the times of Gold Stars, but he deserves a Gold Star card. Just because who he is. And here we have the packs. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten celebrations packs. You've got Two Darkness Blaze, a Vivid Voltage, a Battle Styles, and a Chilling Rain. So we'll start with these standard packs, get them open so that we can find in these. Start with the Chilling Rain, the most modern of these packs. <clears throat> Obviously, as we all know, Looking out for those legendary birds in this set. There is the code card if you would like to use that. See what we've got. Fire energy. Expedition uniform. Hat trim. Flaffy. Galarian Yamask. Snorunt. Brown Sweet. Cubfu. Inkay, cast form as our reverse, and the rare is a Shadow Rider Calyrex. Now, I was not expecting that from these packs, so much so that I haven't even got my sleeves ready. But that is quite a hit to get out of. One of these boxes. Look at that. What a card. I'll pop that at the back. Hopefully that means that we haven't peaked too soon with our first one. Let's open up our battle styles, see what we can get in here. <coughs> Hopefully more of the same. There's our battle styles code card. We've got Water Energy, Luxio, Weeping Bell, Indeedee, Capnia, Mawil, Spunk, Galarian Mr. Mime, Scatterbug, Houndor as our reverse, and our rare is a Crobat Hollow. Nice. Couple of good hits already. Vivid Voltage next. <laughs> Will I finally get the Rainbow Pikachu? Let's see, let's see. There is the code card. And we have got Lightning Energy. Nuzleaf. Memory Capsule, Giraffe Rig, Dedene, Piggy Peck, Tutel, Rylou, Chimchow, Mudsdale as our reverse, and our, our rare is a Whimsy Cart. Okay. Right, keep this going, keep it going. Darkness of Blaze next. <clears throat> there is your code card. We all know what we want from here. 
Charizard is what we're after. So there we go. Steel Energy. Big Parasol. Shinetic. Rose. Skarmory. Cubchoo. Wimpod. Bunnelby. Toxel. Zuelus as our reverse. And our rare is a hollow pin kerchin. Nice, nice. So actually, these other packs are giving us some pretty good hits here. So we've got two hollows, an ultra rare, and then just a non-hollow rare. Not what I was expecting. But here we go. Water energy. Fetchinda. Goforita. Kabu. Pansage. Tauros. Diglett. Squavet. Shelmet. Reverse is Soul Rock. And a Rainbow Butterfree V Max. Wow, that is quite something. We go, you see that a bit better there. So, from five packs, we have got ourselves two hyper rare cards. There, lots of value in those two, and then we've also got our two hollows, the crowbat and the pin urchin as well so hopefully that keeps going when we get to all of these celebrations packs so 10 of those to open for those who don't know they are only four card packs so inside these you will get at least two from the first set That'll be your first two cards. So there's your code card for the celebrations. Not going to be able to use that till Friday. But write it down, make a note of it. Come back to this video on Friday. So let's see who we've got. We're starting off with a Zekrom. So this is from the standard set. Some nice kind of inky swirls up there. Second one is a Lugia. And then this third card is where we could get the throwback card. So this could be one of the reprints from the older series. And it is not, but it is a ho -Ho. So this is the one that is opposite to the Lugia. They look like they are performing a rap video together, opposite each other. It's very cool how they match them up. And then the fourth card is where we could get the um, full art from the first series. So you could get any of those Pikachus or hopefully that golden Mew. Oh, and we've got the standard Mew. Not quite the golden one. But still, look at that hollow. Very, very nice. Very nice card. Next pack. <laughs> hey, code card for you again. And our first one is Groudon. Very nice with the trainer in it as well. Some good hollow there. A Palkia. Quite a simple hollow on that one. Still good nonetheless. Our third card is a reprint. Whoa. That is the Umbreon. Look at that. 
Umbreon Gold Star. It's one of my favourite cards when it first came out. It's got the speckled hollow on it. That is beautiful. Very happy with that. And then the last one is where we can get a full art from that first series. And we have got the Zamazenta V. So you can see how in some packs you can get two really good hits. Whereas in other packs like that first one we had, you could get four of the standard cards. But those two, very, very nice cards. So let's put him back there with the Greninja Gold Star. All right, let's see who we get to next. There we go, there's your code card again. Probably already saw this when I opened the pack, but there he is, it's Xerneas. A nice hollow. Like the swish on the front, makes it look more like an action shot. Very nice. Then got a Cosmog. Looks like he's having a little sulk. Very good, with the trainer in there as well. Nice bit of hollow on that, and let's see who we've got next. A Wyvertol. Very nice. And the final one is the Pikachu Full Art card. This is a beautiful card. It's one of the ones that I really wanted out of the set. It's got the little Caterpie hiding up in the corner as well. And I really like what they've done with it, where they've enhanced the image to make it the whole card image that you got on the original Pikachu cards. That is great and going to be a very popular card, I'm sure. Let's pop him down over there. All right. There we go, next pack code card. And who have we got? We've got ho -Oh again. Xerneas again. Oh, and then we've got another one of these older cards. Here comes Team Rocket. Nice hollow on it. Bit of bleed and it is nice and textured as well. It's very nice. Meows. Staring eyes. That's a very nice card. I like that one. And the final one is the Professor's Research. So this is the one with his arm coming out through the card. Like he's drawing on the card, making it up for you. Again, very good. Not sure if that counts as one of the full art cards. But still, it's in that full art slot. So we'll see if we get any more in any of the other ones. But still, very nice card. Keep going with the next one. Code card. Starting with Cosmog again. And Zekrom again. So you can see that this first set is starting to fill up quite nicely here. We've got quite a few from that first set. Just from five packs already. Yeah, five packs. There's another Zekrom. Dialga. He's a new one. And another Zamazenta V. So we'll pop him there as well. So yeah, I imagine with this one, the first set we're going to get quite quickly. Probably everything apart from that Golden Mew going to be the subset that we're going to be chasing for. There's your code card. Another Xerneas. There we 
we go. A Cosmoem. It's a new one that we haven't seen before. Nice there with the trainer art on it. We've got another Zekrom. And our final one is the Surfing Pikachu. Look at that chunky boy on a surfboard. That is a very nice card again. Bit of texture to it as well. Very, very good. Another one I was chasing for. Pop him. Right there. That's all we got. Four packs left. Get these opened. <clears throat> there is your code card again. Kyogre. Again, another new one. Not seen this one yet. Team Aqua with that one in there. Oh, so that's probably who the Groudon's with. So that would have been Team Magma there and Team Aqua there. Very nice that they're then opposite each other when they're from the same sets. Let's do like that Kyogre. Another Wyvertal. Xerneas again. And a Lunala. Again with the trainer in the background. Nice hollow on that one. Good action shot. Okay, starting to get a little bit full down here. <clears throat> Code card again. Groudon again. And Kyogre both in the same pack. Nice. Oh, I've missed one here. Okay, so there is Solgaleo with the trainer in the background again. Nice one, nice one. And then our possible flashback is the Shining Magikarp. That is cool. With that speckled hollow. Again, a bit of texture on the card. He looks very, very nice. Beautiful card. Very happy with that one. Okay, two more packs to go. Code card. We've got another Zekrom. Another Hero. Ah, oh, and a Zekrom again. But this is from Black and White. That is a very nice hollow one there for that full art card. That is really, really cool. See the speckled, and then you get the second hollow pattern. That is actually better than I was expecting. A very beautiful card. Let's take that one away. And we've got another Mew to go with it as well. Okay. Last pack. Let's see what we're going to get out of this one. Code card for you. And then Y Veltel, Y Veltel again. Cosmog again. Groudon. And our last one is another full heart Pikachu.
Very nice card. That is the second one from the box. So that is all the packs done there. As you can see, we got our Zekrom, Shining Magikarp, Here comes Team Rocket. And we got the Umbreon Gold Star as our flashback cards. So four out of 10, not too bad. That's kinda going with the hit rate that we expect, about 40%. For the full arts, we got a bit more. So we got the Surfing Pikachu, Two of the full art Pikachus, two Zamazentas, and the Professor's Research, I think, is a full art as well. So that is six. Six out of ten for those. So a little bit better for those ones. And then, of course, we got these two at the back here as well. The Butterfree and the Shadow Rider. Neither of which I was really expecting to pull. But that is some going. I mean, I quite enjoyed looking at some of those flashback cards. I don't know what you guys thought, um, which ones your favourites are. But I'm definitely looking forward to trying to complete this whole set, getting all these cards, definitely trying to get all my Pikachus, and hopefully at some point getting those original three, the Charizard, the Blastoise, and the Venusaur starters. Um, and maybe even that golden Mew, if I am lucky enough. So we'll be opening as much of the products as we can on this channel. So keep a lookout. We'll put some links at the end for you. Check out the rest of the channel for all those other videos. And thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.